What's good, A1 gang? Y'all know we had to get to this. Man, this is the fast food tier list, man. This is something new, but I'm seeing these videos being, you know what I'm saying, made right now. I think this was an original video from iDubs, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to iDubs for this one. But what we doing in this video is basically ranking the tiers. Of so here we go. We got the S category. I believe this is like the special category, the best category. Then we got the A, B, C, D, F. And this question mark category, I took the liberty to just throw a couple that I never either heard of or ate at before. Like, let's say Panera Bread. I have heard of that, but that was a coffee spot and like a little bread spot back in the day. So I never really ate nothing from there. Jack in the Box, I have uh, heard of. Zaxby's, I've heard of, but both of these places I never ate before. Jersey Mike's, I've heard of, never ate there. Sonic, heard of, never ate there. A&W, heard of, never ate there. Auntie Anne's, I had a pretzel from there in the mall, but it was like a pretzel stand, so I don't really count it as like a fast food place. Uh, <clears throat> El Pollo Loco, heard of that, but never ate there before. Long John Silver's, heard of it, never ate there. I don't even know what this is or what this one is right here or this here. I heard of Whataburger. Never ate there. I don't know what this one is. So these is the other places that I have ate. So what we're going to do is rank these places. And I want y'all to tell me, you know what I'm saying, what do y'all think of my list? Do y'all agree with the ones that I put, you know, in the places that I put them, or do y'all disagree? Let me know, man. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see how we going to start this off, man. Right away, Boston Market, can't stand they ass. That's like the... I don't know if they be trying to do like, they got, okay, so they do this home style type of meal thing, but it's terrible. Everything be flavorless. So I'm putting them straight in F category. They don't put no, I don't know, a little bit of seasoning, but it ain't like how it really supposed to be. You know what I'm saying? It be plain as hell. Uh, Jimmy John's, I fuck with Jimmy John's, tough. I fuck with Jimmy John's. Jimmy John's could get. I'm going to sit Jimmy John's right here in the B for right now. Nah, they can get an A. I'm going to sit Jimmy John's in the A for right now. I'm going to think about it. I might move them down. Mm, no, nah, they got to move down one. Chick-fil-A, definitely in the A category. Chick-fil-A might even get in the S category. Chick-fil-A go crazy. They the only restaurant that I know of. When you pull up, they take your name. You know what I'm saying? They super nice. It's just ridiculous at, at Chick-fil-A. And then the food, perfect every time. And then they got waffle fries. Nobody else got waffle fries. Okay, let's see. Burger King. Burger King, I fuck with the Whopper, but that's pretty much the only thing I like from Burger King. You wouldn't really catch me ordering too many other things from there. Let me think. What do I think about the other food from there? It be trash. The other shit from Burger King be trash. But the, from the Whopper alone, I'll put I'll put Burger King in the C category. Just off the strength of the Whopper with cheese, man. Let me know if y'all agree with this, too. Uh, Quiznos. This is like a jank Subway. Subway is not as good as Jimmy John's. So I'll put Subway in like the, Subway can get a C, Subway in the C category. And I'll put Quiznos. <clears throat> I never really, ha I had a couple sandwiches from here. They weren't bad, but they wasn't the best either. You know what I'm saying? So I guess Quiznos can get a C because they was the first people I heard doing the baked bread shit, if I'm not mistaken. McDonald's, I'm tired of McDonald's right now, but overall, McDonald's done been there for everybody, you know what I'm saying? Everybody grew up off McDonald's. My favorite thing from there, I'll say like a quarter pounder, double quarter pounder with cheese. That motherfucker be fire. Uh, let's see, let's see. What category should McDonald's be in? See, the McDonald's where I'm at, they be fucking up your order a lot. McDonald's, y'all got to get y'all shit together. All these franchises y'all got, they be fucking people orders up. So McDonald's could have got a B, but I'm going to throw McDonald's in the C category, man. Yeah, I'm going I'm to sit them right there for right now. Uh, KFC. 
I don't know what's been going on, but I feel like KFC been using clone chicken. And ever since the clone chicken been in, KFC been terrible. I don't like nothing from KFC except for the famous bowl. So I'm going I'm to put KFC in the D category. It ain't as bad as where Boston Market, but it's in the D category. Checkers. Checkers is a... I really thought Checkers was a hood restaurant. I didn't know Checkers was as, as worldwide, not as worldwide, but as uh, national as it actually is. But I heard they use rallies, the name rallies for Checkers in other regions. So where I'm at, it's called Checkers. But in your uh, region, it might be called rallies. But Checkers is like, <clears throat> it always be some, some hood motherfuckers working at Checkers. So you liable to get your food. Don't ever come high look on the picture. But I do love them chili cheese fries, though, so I ain't going to do Checkers too, bogus. I might, I don't like nothing else from Checkers, though. Checkers can go in the D category. Dairy Queen, only thing I had from there before was they hot dogs. I had ice cream, too. So Dairy Queen, I'm going to throw them in the uh, F category as far as food. I don't know, I never really had it. For the ice cream, because they got those dolly dillies, they call some I don't know. The, it's like a circle chocolate ice cream. It's ch hard shell chocolate around the outside with vanilla ice cream in the middle, man. Because of that, I'll throw Dairy Queen in the D category. Just because I don't want to see it next to Bar Boston Market. I really don't like Boston Market. Dunkin' Donuts, they don't really got food, but they donuts be fire. Dunkin' Donuts always hold it down. Dunkin' Donuts can get a, hmm. I ain't talking about for their breakfast or nothing like that. Just for their donuts. I throw Dunkin' Donuts on a D category. Uh, Five Guys. I had this like twice before. Uh, once when I went, I went on a, a road trip. We went to like New York, Connecticut. A couple places. And I had it there for the first time. And then I had it again once I came home. And these motherfuckers was fire, man. Let me see. We gonna throw them on a... Five guys get an A. They the first ones in our A category. Let's see who gonna join them, man. See, now they, they should have had Culver's on here. Now, if y'all don't know about Culver's, man, Google Culver's, man. Culver's would have been on this A tier right here. The only reason why Culver's wouldn't have been in the S tier is because they, they don't, the customer service ain't as good as, as Chick-fil-A. And then Chick-fil-A chicken just be ridiculous. But uh, Popeye's, let's see, man. Now, this is a – Popeye's has a special place to me, man. If I go somewhere and I want to feel like home, you know what I'm saying, I ain't got no other restaurants that I recognize and they got a Popeye's, I'm going straight to Popeye's, man. Popeye's. If they got honey, man, they got to start having some fucking honey. I really don't eat the honey all the time, but sometimes when you when I do eat the biscuits, I definitely want honey with it. I'm not eating a biscuit without honey. Y'all got to get y'all honey together, man. But I'll put Popeye's in the... Nah. That shit can be good as hell. I ain't going to lie. Popeye's can get a B. Let's see. Let's see. We ain't do Taco Bell yet. Let me see. Let me get Taco Bell up here. Them chalupas, them, uh, hmm, them, them quesadillas, the gorditas, or whatever they call, man, I fuck with them, the ones with the, with the cheese, with the taco in the middle, with the wrap around the outside, I think that's the chalupa, Taco Bell can get a, and you can't really fuck up Taco Bell, you know what I'm saying? It's hard to fuck up some a taco with ground beef and putting tomato and lettuce on it. Uh, rest of these, okay, Wendy's. We got Wendy's over here. Let's throw Wendy's up here real fast. Wendy's with the faux 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 and they chicken tenders. Wendy's can get a C, man. We're going to put Wendy's on the C. Cinnabon, them motherfuckers be good as hell, but I never really have food from there. 
So I'm going to put them in the same category as Dunkin' Donuts, just off the strength of their center buns. Now, D category is not necessarily bad. It just means they don't got, to me, more than one thing to offer that I like. So like with KFC, Famous Balls, Checkers, Chili Cheese Fries, Dairy Queen, Ice Cream, Dunkin' Donuts, Donuts, Cinnabons, Cinnabons. Oh, I never heard of this raising. I heard of this raising canes before, but I never actually seen one in real life. Now, White Castle, this one is special to me. Ever since I seen Harold and Kumar, you know, because we don't got a White Castle in my city. So the nearest one to me is in Chicago, Illinois. So every time I wanted to get some White Castle, I had to go take a trip over there. And I, I used to never leave Chicago without going to White Castle. So I'm going to have to throw White Castle in. Uh... And then they got the onion rings and shit, man. The chicken. Uh... White Castle got some shit over there, man. I'm going to throw White Castle in a B. I fuck with White Castle. Krispy Kreme's delicious. But them the only things they got. So I'm going to throw them in this category. Panda Express. And... D, it's all right. Hardee's, F, I can't stand Hardee's. I don't know what type of, they just be making shit. Uh, in and out, I had this one time. It was basic as fuck. I thought this was going to be some of the best shit I ever had, the way people was making it seem. So I'm going to throw it, but it was all right, but it wasn't, the hype that I was waiting for, it wasn't that. I had this one time in Vegas. Uh, Arby's, I'm going to have to put Arby's on. F. I can't stand Arby's, man. Arby's is right next to to uh Boston Market with me, man. I really can't stand Arby's though. That's the they shit just disgusting. But I think this list looked pretty solid, man. We got Chick Fil A in the S tier, Five Guys in A, Jimmy John's, Popeyes in White Castle, Burger King, Subway, Quiznos, McDonald's, Taco Bell, Wendy's. KFC Checkers, Dairy Queen, Dunkin' Donuts, Cinnabon, Krispy Kreme, Panda Express, In and Out, Boston Market, Hardee's, and Arby's. I think this looked right, man. Let me know what y'all think. Would this would have is this how y'all list would have looked, man? Let me know, man. Drop in the comment section. Let me know what you want to see next. Follow me on Facebook if you got a request or something you want me to get to. Stay down, come up. Make sure you hit like on the fan page. Add me on my regular page. Stay down. Come up. My picture is a YouTube play button, man. Go find me, man. Y'all know, man. A1 Gang, we out.